Okay, today is Monday. You've seen the time, it's almost noon. I haven't done jack, and I'm really in the mood to do jack. And I'll tell you why I don't want to do nothing, but I have to. On your mark, get set, go. Oh, I'm sorry, the mood indicator light says, well, yeah, I woke up today, okay. That's always a good thing, isn't it? See if I can, there you go, boom. There you go, let me turn some lights on. Uh, they're still there, did you do? Okay, I'll be back. Commercial break, like always. Yeah, baby. Okay, what I got to say today. Ah, it's one of those days. Ah, fuck. First, um, You never know where my videos are gonna go, right? Cause I don't know. Um, I'll show you a fucking uh, stupid move. If you guys remember the vet was sitting over here and of course I'm gonna try to jack it up and push it over real quick. You know, cause I don't wanna push the vet back and forth, back and forth. Okay, that's beautiful. So it cost me a $50 fuck up. I'm standing over here with the jack underneath there. And of course, you know that jack isn't gonna roll on that stuff very well. So I kinda try to push it over, really? Really? Yeah, really? You just push it over. And uh, you push against the glass and it breaks. Okay. That's an eight foot piece of glass. Probably, I think three eighths thick, I don't know. Um, yeah, it's about 50 bucks. Oh, did I mention I ain't got no truck to even fucking haul anything? Okay, back to the mood indicator light says it's all good. Um, yeah. Yeah, really? Okay, um, am I in a pissy mood? Yeah, kinda. Um, why? Because I guess I allow myself to be. Made a video yesterday, fucking YouTube turd bombed it. I don't know what happened, man. Um, couldn't spin, blow it off. Video then, they said it was 100% and never aired. Okay, that kind of irritated me, but what are you gonna do? Move on, it's a new week. It's uh, Halloween today. Okay, what do I got to say? This is what I got to say. Rick Fix, Greg Porter, and Jimbo at uh, Shut Your Face Garage. I don't know how you guys do it. I'm going to tell you the truth. You guys got that car, those cars all tore apart. And maybe you guys got more balls than I do. It might be because this car, I don't want this. I should be kind of excited or whatever you want to call it. I'm not. I'm not at all because I don't like anything that doesn't come in this garage on its own power. Um, where do all these wires go? I know where some of them go. You know, um, man, I, 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 I don't, I, I, body work, not a fucking electrician, um, mechanic, you know, what happens when the guy that had this vet, he hacked and packed it, because I can tell, because, um, let me see, oh, there you go, let's not just do the, let's just fucking chop it off, just, just chop it off, okay, um, I could end up being in the same zone this guy did. He took it all apart and he got over his head and I kind of feel like I'm over my head. Because the guy, you know, he bought new bushings for it. They've been sitting in the dirty box. Um, man, if it was time to just do body work, I would be all over it. I'd be into it. I just, this, this makes me leery. You know, um, I don't even have a cherry picker here because my brother's got it, but that's another story. Where I can, I need to, where are we at here? Fuck, I don't even know where we're at. We're somewhere around here. Anyway, I gotta jack that up and put some motor mounts in there. That's a start, and then look at this. This is lovely. Really? You know, um, let's do this again. 
You know, there's no body mounts in this. The sun's out, I, I'll, I'll be grateful for that. Um, did I even push the timer? Really? Let me get, see, you know I have problems with this little thing, but whatever, work around it. Yeah, I'm back. Um, I'm overwhelmed, that's what I am. I don't really want to do this. I really don't because um, I just want to do a little body work. I don't want to bring this fucking car back from the dead. Because it scares me. Because I'm all by myself. I know the rule of thumb just start and someday it'll be done. But man, I'm ready to quit before it even gets started to tell you the truth. Make me nervous as a whore in church, because I, man, really? Cause I'm, like I said, man, I know I'm bouncing off, but this is just me today, this is how it is. If I was, if I was getting ready to do some body work, I'd be excited. Even though body work would irritate me. But, at least the car moves. I, I know what I need to do is take each little section, and don't look at the rest, and then just work off it. I'm just afraid, like, what happened to the S10? This thing's gonna be like 10 months, 10 years, 10 something. <laughs> okay, let's go on to something else. I'm not gonna say it's any positive. Okay, this is what I've been thinking about. Woods 40 touched on it. <clears throat> I talked to uh, just Hogan. Man, you need to check out his channel because we talk, I talked to him like three hours, man, yesterday. It was good. It was all good. I enjoyed it a lot. Anyway, this is what blows my mind. And, and maybe I'll, I'll try to slow down so you guys can understand. If I bought this car and I bought it. It ran good, okay? So I get home and I change the oil and I train, change the transmission fluid like I always do. And then you put new oil on it and it starts knocking. Okay, to me, that means somebody put an additive in it to make the knock go away. And you would feel that you got fucked. Because I've seen this happen before too. I've never done it, but I've seen it happen. Where you get so much blow by in a motor that a person will actually drill a hole right here, the back of the tap covers, and run a tube down underneath the car. So, when the oil is blown by the rings, you don't notice it. And when you get home, you're pretty fucking pissed off because you've been misled. You have got fucked over. They represented it, the car to be something more than what it is. I think everybody agrees with me that they'd be fucking pissed off. Okay, now why is this? This is my fucking pet peeve. People take a car. You got a fucking hole on it. And if they're doing it for themselves, that's beautiful. I got no, I got no bitch on that. But this is my bitch. You take a hole. And you fucking pack it with a tube sock or tin foil or fucking screen, mar glass, fucking bondo, something. I call it hacky sacking. Or even if you do weld some metal on it, you tack weld it, and then you just fucking mar glass the fuck out of it. You know it ain't gonna last. But you put it up for sale and you want big dollar. You misled the motherfucker. I don't care. How you look at it? You fucking misled. You hacky sack the bitch. I just fucking, I guess the reason it pisses me off because when I bought my first Camaro, when I started doing it in, in uh, auto body, I fucking started saying on it and it fucking had tube socks all in the fucking wheel wells. Had a stop sign and a passenger side. That fucking misled me. You know, it, I know there's flipper cars, but you know what, when you ask big fucking money for something that ain't even remotely fucking nice, and this is what pissed me really off, the people that do it, they fucking, man, they could do better work than that. 
They just do it because they can get a fucking way with it. It's like, just like when I get a car. You know how it is. People don't scuff the fucking paint. The last cocksucking painter don't even scuff the fucking paint. And then somebody else does a paint job on it, and it's fucking a nightmare. Anyway, that's my fucking pet peeve. Take it for what it's worth. This car's got me overwhelmed. Um, I'm not even excited about it. Because I don't know where to start, but I do. It's just, I don't want, it's like the house. I don't want to fucking do the wiring. You know, if it was something like this, this is some beautiful fucking body work. Now, I'm not pro body, man. Trust me. You know, I'm sure there's bolts in there and they fucking mud. I'm, I'm, I bet you there's mud in there. Mud in like crazy. I don't even know if they put fire. See, there you go. Ugh. You know what? And that doesn't even bother me. You know what I mean? Because I kind of know how long it's going to take. I'm just going to take the whole fucking nose off. I got to cut it, whatever. And, and work on it. But, uh, rewire, fucking test light, fucking analyze, ain't gonna keep it, kind of want to, because if I keep it, it's just gonna set in the back pad like it does with everything else. <sighs> What do you do? Another day in fucking paradise. Do a little dance, make a little love, get down tonight. Woo! Yeah. Trying to get myself in a good mood. But, fuck, I probably just close the fucking garage. I'm, I'm, I'm already tired of looking at this thing. And it's sad because I should be excited about it, but I ain't. I, be, I know, I said it before and I'll say it again. I'm doing some body work on it. Getting ready to paint, that'd be good, but reconstructing this thing, I guess gotta look at it like this. Put the motherfucker back together. Don't fall in love with the car. Because I always do every car, if I can fall in love with it, just put the motherfucker back together and sell it. Do I consider hacking and packing? No. Because, um, no, I'm not gonna buy every fucking new part, new bolt, new everything. No, I'm fucking not gonna, because I'm not keeping the cocksucker. That's why I get carried away, is that I want to. Fuck that, man. Man, fuck that. You gotta get paid down the shoe. You gotta get some fucking cars up in here. Fuck all this, your own personal shit. Stuff got to go, don't you know? And God forbid someday I'm gonna have to do a hat and pack. Guess you gotta get paid. I don't know where the happy fucking medium is. Anyway. Sun's out. Let me see if this video actually makes it. I don't know what happened last night. Kept me, I'm not even gonna explain it. It ain't worth it because people don't wanna hear this shit. Peace of mind. Peace of oneself. I fucked the mechanic over here. Electrician. Peace on earth, rest in peace, internal peace, bigger peak of the pie, piece of the action, and I don't know fucking rest, and yeah, wait, okay, let, let me think of something real good, um, <laughs> there you go, that's the best it gets, and when the big dogs get all done eating, even the pugs get a piece of something, motherfucker. Oh, and here is my thing. Nah, probably shouldn't go there. Yeah. Probably shouldn't go there. 16 minutes. Yeah. I wish all the evil people in the world. Nah, I'm, 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 no. Peace, people.